one of the things that separates Gmail from other email solutions is that in Gmail you search for email messages as opposed to sorting them. If you're used to using Yahoo or Outlook or Hotmail, then you've probably used to seeing the header row above your emails that have um, columns such as subject, date, um, size, uh, attachments, things like that. By clicking on those header rows, you can sort your email messages accordingly, and that helps you find them. And while this is a nice idea, if you have a lot of email messages, this isn't very helpful. In Gmail, you'll notice there are no header columns. Instead of sorting your email, you search for it. Up at the top, there's a search box. You simply type in a few words and then click search. Displayed are all of the email messages which contain some reference to the search phrase Google Group. That's nice, but I still have a lot of emails. So we can add some uh, little more sophisticated search uh, queries. For example, you can type two colon and then um, type in an email message. So I'll search for one of the groups that I'm in. And this shows me all the email messages from that email address. You can also do from colon and then select an email address and that will show you all the emails uh, that were sent from that person. A couple other ones include subject. If you type in subject and then a keyword, it will show you all the email messages with a word in the subject line. You can type um, has colon, and if you're looking for an email message with an attachment, that's a great way to do it. So only it, emails with an attachment are shown. You can use the search term in colon and then specify a folder or a tag that you've created so let's say I want to look in the trash folder so I would say in trash search and it will show me all the email address all the emails in my trash folder alternately you can also say is and this is where um, if it's unread or starred or important or unimportant you can find it so we'll say I want to find all of the starred emails. You can also use the is search feature to look for chat. So if I say is chat, it will show me all of the chats that I have previously um, done. The nice thing is you can combine these things together. So let's say I want to find um, email message with um, the subject that has Google in it and it's going to be in my um, archive folder and um, it has attachment and if there was an email that matched that it would show up so you can string these search terms together to help you find your email messages quicker